So DJ Academics has a friend named Little Boom, and Little Boom was caught, you know, touching women and young girls unsolicited in Walmart. I know that sounds crazy. That's the truth. It's on video. Oh, ooh. or uh, do do uh, do uh, 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 what champagne champagne? champagne. Pop, do Poppy's home? Nah, it's slow though. Yeah, but so I feel like it ain't coming. Or just do fair trade. What is this? Look. So this is DJ Academics. That's his friend, little boom right there. This is the tweet. Thanks to our Facebook followers, this person was identified. Uh, his name is Shannon Jawan Adams, 23. He also goes by Lil Boom. Can you identify? We need your help identifying this person of interest. He was seen walking around inside of Walmart, located on Easy Street inside Walmart. He inappropriately touched the backside of multiple people, including children. He left in a red sedan, possibly a 2011 Chevrolet Impala. If you have any additional information about this individual, please call Officer Prather at 352-369-7000. Or leave an anonymous tip at Ocala Crime Stoppers. Ocala? I think that's Ocala, Florida. I think that's Ocala, Florida. Um, they, they, they've, got them on, they've got them on tape. This is the tape. This is the tape right here. That's Lil Boom. That's a woman. Don't know if y'all don't see his hands. He does it once. He's got his phone out. Looks like he's using it to take some pictures. He goes back for another. Yeah. I mean, this is a, this is a sick guy. This is a, a, oh, oh, he didn't get enough. He didn't get enough, chat. He comes back and takes another picture. Takes another picture. And then another picture. Multiple pictures from this guy. Multiple pictures from this guy. This is the guy, uh, if you're familiar with the song Fuck Steph Curry, this is the guy that made the song Fuck Steph Curry. Fuck Steph Curry. Fuck Steph Curry. Him and Act became friends. Um, and yeah, he is out here. Again, look at this guy. This little girl taking pictures of a little girl. Hold on, let me, let me go back. This little girl right there taking pictures of the little girl. That's that same woman right there. There's other pictures or other videos of him with grown women as well. Um, I don't I don't necessarily know how at got it. I don't know how at got it. But he started to react to some of it. He started to react to actual footage right there. Where I'm going straight now. <laughs> Mind you, they're on the phone together. They're on the phone together this whole time. Straight down. I ain't, I ain't stay. I ain't stay. I ain't look around. I ain't look behind me. I ain't say, oh shit. Oh my God. I ain't say, oh, let me get my phone. I kept walking. Why is your hand out? I just told you I, I was on air, so I was trying to like, on some like, move my fuck out of my way type shit. Which I do say, like, bro, I. I can straight apologize for that, like, but uh, I did not touch nobody's ass, and my intentions is not, was not right there. Where I'm going, straight. He's he's copping, please, man. He's trying to he's trying to he's trying to make it make sense. I got some more footage of act. Shouts out to Thirteen Heat Culture, man. Appreciate you, Thirteen Heat Culture. This is this, appreciate the sub. Again, this is this is this right here is the moment. This right here apparently is the moment where he finds out. But the video. Like th that that video is damning. Like it just looked like what what was what was trying to be spun versus what you see. Is no, you, you, you play this. Like, yeah. like 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 I'm, I'm thinking with my brain. Like and, and 
I want to hear the things. I don't even think there's nothing. So, so, for example, when I watch the video, you're like, I'm not following them. My brain is saying, no, you're following them. Like, nigga, anybody with a brain would say that. You're following them. My nigga, as soon as they left, you turned that way and you walked that way behind them. I just explained that, though. No, I, I, I hear the explanation, but the, like, in even the explanation, like, play this. If I just get into a little awkward situation, I don't immediately follow the people. If if they're spooked, I'm spooked. It's anecdotal, though. Oh, my brother. Ooh, Jesus. I beg your pardon. That's nasty. I beg your pardon. That's gross. Now, I see what you're saying. Like, I do see what you're saying. It's just if this was so clear cut, black and white, the charges would show that. Like, for sure, 100%. But I, and, I, and my, I'm not here. If people want to question it and do that, that's cool. But I am like to call me something I am not. I'm not even having it. I'm not. So you can say, "Oh, that look crazy." It's not in your def like the public is on your side. I and and that right there is I, is the moment that academics knew what it was and had to make a decision. But what what gets even worse is that academics, uh, I guess later on in that same stream, gets a text from Mr. Boom. He gets a text from Mr. Boom. Let, let's look at let's look at act di diagnosis footage though. Let's look let's look at this. Look, let's look at this real quick. His hand with seemingly his phone, like he's trying to take pictures of her buttocks while she's crouched down. You see his hand? She's crouched down. She's unaware. He holds it there. You're going to see this woman up here. This. Oh, they got the 360 footage on this nigga. This nigga's done. They've got the, they've got the Insta 360 footage on him. He is done. He's cooked. Oh, man. Not again. He's cooked. Woman right here is seeing this behavior because there's a guy holding out of camera phone, seemingly, underneath a woman who's crouched down looking at makeup. Oh, he's done. Brother, this ain't no excusable shit. Yeah, this is done. That's done. This is where you can see he gets caught. Wow. Wow. This is where he gets caught. This person here catches him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. He hears the card or something. He pulls, pulls the phone back. He actually puts it back. Look. Oh, brother. He lied. Y'all niggas worship him. His hand with seemingly his phone, like he's trying to take pictures of her buttocks while she's crouched down. You see his hand? She's crouched down. She's unaware. He holds it there. You're going to see this woman up here. This woman right here. Is seeing this behavior because there's a guy holding out of camera phone, seemingly, underneath a woman who's crouched down looking at makeup. Brother, this ain't no excusable shit. You can't, you can't escape that. Come on now. You can't, you 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 can't deny that. Then you get greedy. You cannot deny that. You cannot deny that. I'm going to open up the conversation after this last clip because after all this backing and forth and um, Lil Boom comes out and admits what he did to academics. Yeah. <laughs> Lil Boom comes out and admits to academics what he did. I'm going to open up the conversation after this because I don't blame academics for any of this. I see a lot of people on the internet blaming academics. Oh, what you didn't know? You didn't know? Your man, your man was caught up on six offender charges, and you didn't know? You didn't know? I don't I don't blame Mac for this. I do want to ask something, but first we got to watch this. We do got to watch Lil Boom admit to what he did. He, uh, he uh, texted me. He said, you know, Ac, I'm a... Uh... I'm going to sit or say it only to you, nobody else, and apologize to you 
for not telling beforehand and basically making it look stupid. You helped me through so much. Wow, that's a real friend. He's losing a real friend right now. That's what this is looking like. This is crazy. And I looked at you like a big brother. I heard you say get help, but I want you to know since that day, I've gotten help. And I've grown so much since then. I quit smoking, got off drugs, and changed my whole life around. What I did was wrong. Indirectly or not, I was just not in the right headspace whatsoever. I wish you the best thing in life and in the future. I'm going to continue to better myself and take this as a growing experience. Wow. Ak is Ak is actively crying. And I don't think this is drunk Ak. I don't think this is this is legitimate tears rolling down his face. Um because his homeboy just admitted that he was taking pictures and touching touching little girls. Yeah. And he ended stream off of that. Um I don't I don't know what what headspace you got to be in to actively touch kids. Um I don't I don't I don't know what headspace that is. I don't know what drugs make you do that. I don't I don't know what drugs make you touch kids as well. I really do not I don't get that one either. Um you know, that's weird to me. Um yeah, strange. Now, because he is famous and because he is not a likable character for a lot of people, uh, of course, naturally, people want to point at academics and ask him, you know, did you did you know? Did you know? They got your mans on assault charges. Yeah, the nigga you be hanging with. The nigga you be hanging with. Oh, yeah. Offender, and it was your man. It, it was, was your boy. You grew up with him. That's crazy, man. You ain't know what he was doing. You ain't feel bad at all. Like no guilt, none of. Them. I got your man. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna open up the conversation. Let me be serious for, for two seconds. I wanna, I wanna open up the conversation. Yeah, I don't think academics would have known, but there are times in which people around us exhibit behaviors or patterns of behaviors or signs and you can do something about it you can do something about it at the bare minimum you can distance yourself i'm not i'm not saying that you can stop them because if that person wants to do what they want to do it's sick and disgusting you should tell people you know so they can uh, uh secure themselves the best that they can but at the end of the day that grown man was going to do what that grown man wanted to do and what that grown man wanted to do was touch uh little 10 year old girls in the walmart and 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 take pictures uh, of women's buttocks uh as they squat down to get makeup that's what he wanted to do um so so not necessarily um to academics specifically but just the conversation of you know sometimes you you see things in life and they are signs and it's not it's not something to push push aside it's not it's not. Um, and it doesn't necessarily even have to be as deep as, oh, this person is a person that would essay somebody, you know, do something offensive sexually to somebody. Just something that you would feel is, is borderline creepy. I know when everybody was a freshman, they they were they were looking at the seniors who the senior guys who were coming down and were dating freshman girls or whatever and said to themselves, oh, that's disgusting. 
They're 18 years old. We're 13, 14 years old. That's disgusting. I would never. I would never do no shit like that. That's gross. That's gross. But then when you became, you, you and your friends said it, but then when you became a senior, you had that one or two other seniors that were fooling around with freshmen that you knew. Y'all know. Don't act like y'all don't know. <laughs> and I know somebody's going to say that's not a big deal. That's the, th these are the signs. It's all not a big deal until it's something, right? And, that, and I think that that's a lot of people's problem. It's, it's never a big deal until it's something that happens. It's never a big deal until it's something that happens. And personally, I think that we need to check that before it develops into something that happens. Shame it. Let's, let's, let's not be okay with just a lot of things that come out of people's mouths. If you care about these people, let's really check on these people. Let's really check on these people. Let's be strict in, in, in our standards and, and, you know, the things that we uphold as sacred and important and stuff like that. But definitely don't let the small stuff slide. Because when you, when you let the small stuff slide, that's when it becomes the big stuff. It's not big now until it's big. That's, that's how snowballs get formed avalanches and stuff like that it's not big until it's big it had to start small it is it it had this everything big started small so when were you going to be the one to say you know what this is not something that i want to get big i need to prepare for this mentally physically or whatever the case may be i need to stop i need to stop them you understand what i'm saying i need to warn others around hey i ain't gonna lie Jeff is going down this path. I can't really, I can't really mess with Jeff no more. Hey, I know y'all said that that was my man's. I'm here to tell y'all that's not my man's no more. Because now, and not that I'm saying it's right, academics' name is attached to this. Your name could be attached to this. So, hey man, don't ignore the small stuff. That's that's all I want to say. I, 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 it's, it's messed up that academics lost a friend, um, but it's also a good thing that he lost a friend who is willing to touch on little girls inside public places and, and take pictures of women. So, 